So, we've got some uh, interesting news these last few days, haven't we? Afghanistan has fallen to the Taliban. And again, as I said in my video, they gave President, President Biden all these questions. Are you sure we're not going to have another Vietnam? Essentially, you know, helicopters coming into the embassy, lifting people out. Oh, oh of course not, of course not. They literally set them up word for word to what just happened. You couldn't make it up. You couldn't accidentally get it so right. Therefore, in my opinion, this is all, again, a stage, a big show. And as I sat here this morning, I thought, enter Hunter Biden in the news soon. And maybe Nancy Pelosi, similarly. But the Biden, Hunter Biden timeline, Woo Dude has told us about that. He said it's still on. The Spirit's not telling me anything different. So I think we're going to hear about Hunter Biden really, really soon in the news. Okay? And again, followed by his father in the news. And then bye-bye Joe Biden from the presidency because of certain reasons. And I'm not talking about election reasons. Okay? Um, or, or the 2020 election. I'm talking about other reasons he has to leave. Um, they're now... His allies, including CNN, are posting the shit show of Afghanistan. So if they're always covering for him, which they always have been, they would not be doing so now uncovering it, <laughs> making him look like a moron. And they're saying, oh, well, some leaked intelligence said that the, the, his intelligence sources told him there was, you know, an issue with Afghanistan and uh, he didn't, you know, he didn't listen. And, uh, uh, and then Trump comes out, oh, he should resign. Uh, they, they should impeach him because... Uh, his abject failure in Afghanistan. So, enter his son, Hunter, in conjunction with that, and I think whatever is going to happen with his son, which we haven't said yet, but it'll just be too much for Papa Biden to handle. And away he goes. I think that's what we're about to witness here shortly. Really soon. And Durham has impaneled a grand jury on the evidence of his investigation over the last two plus years now, whatever it was, about two years. All right now, probably nothing. 